hello. Um, it's been a while since I did a video, like a sit down talk. This video has bad lighting, I am very sorry. This video is also going to be me attempting another special effects look. I pretty much just see a look online and I screenshot it and hope for the best. So today we are going to do a look, like a card look. I'm going to insert a picture that I saw on Pinterest. So I don't know how I'm going to do this. latex on the back of this card and hope for the best. I've been sitting here for half an hour. It honestly could have been like five minutes, but when you're dying of boredom, you lose all sense of time. Hi, it's looking more real now. So I just put foundation on and now I'm going to take some of my cream paints Maybe some eyeshadows, whatever you have. Bruised. <laughs> um, yeah, just take your brushes or fingers, whatever you want to use, and bruise it up. First, I'm just going to go with... It's a dark gray, but it's... Yeah, I'm going to put red over it after, just so it darkens up. Also, I left like a little flap-ish around here so it looks like it dug in the skin. And I'm gonna put some dark in there so it looks like it's actually in, you know? It's like contouring, but with your incision. I'm gonna take this brown a little bit and put it around, cause you know, bruising. I don't have to explain it, you know. Wait, I'm trying to explain it like I know what I'm doing. Like, I'm... These are attempted videos, you know? I've done, like, some really cool looks that I didn't get on video. But I can put some pictures in here. They're actually kind of cool. I'm gonna take my color wheel that I got from Spirit Halloween. <laughs> take some red that's almost out. And yeah. And this eyeshadow palette is from the dollar store. Don't worry if you leave some places untouched around here. If you can't get the little cracks and stuff, we're gonna put blood over it so it doesn't really matter. looking kind of cool. For a beginner, it's looking really cool. Also, if you haven't noticed, I got my hair cut. It grew a little bit since then, but I got it cut and I got re-dyed. Just the ends, like purple. It's a vegan hair dye called Manic Panic and it's really cute. Uh, it's semi-permanent, so. I'm gonna use a brush to spread this blood around. take my finger and kind of rub it around because I just realized that why would blood be on the skin flaps you know what I mean? It should be on the card. You know? Kind of messed up. I'm gonna try to take this brush and flick. Oh, yep. Yeah, there we go. Flick some blood. Now I'm just gonna take this thing. I don't know what it's called. But it's that thing. Dip it in the blood. And just Dab it on the card. What the hell, man? It's supposed to. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Don't freak out, don't freak out, don't freak out. Oh! 
Blood is supposed to fix everything. Why is it not fixing everything? Before I have another panic attack, what I'm gonna do is take the gray and put it in some, hello, put it in some creases, make it darker. Try to save this. I'm gonna take my Dollarama spray blood. But it's pretty much just food coloring, but it's still cool. And help it, like drip. You know? Yeah, it doesn't look that cool, really, but it kind of is from far away. If you see me walking down the street, you want to ask me if I'm okay. You know what I mean? <laughs> so, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up and let me know down in the comments what you want to say next time.